Pepio modelling paste will add an extra dimension to your work. It can be squeezed straight from the tube and either applied with a brush or knife to create texture to your surface of your painting. Depending on how thick it is in different areas, it dries at different speeds. So it's best to leave it to dry overnight before you put any colour on top. You can mix the texture paste with colour, so you create a coloured texture paste. I'm mixing with acrylic and you can see the colour still remains, but what it will do is create a nice textured effect. And again, depending on the thickness of colour, it will vary in the times it takes to dry, so best leave it overnight. This is one I left to dry overnight and this will show you that you can apply colour on top of your texture and you can see the effects that it makes, just adding that real lovely extra dimension to your work. Another fun thing to do with the modelling paste is to use a stencil. Just put your stencil down on your canvas or paper. I like to just squeeze it in. Then using a palette knife or anything else to spread it around. I quite like the fact that it can be still quite rough and textured once you remove the stencil. Vary the direction in which you apply it. This does ensure that you have better coverage. And then simply peel back your stencil to reveal your image. So once this is dried, again, best to leave it overnight. You can then drop your colours in, you can paint over it, you can have a lot of fun.